up guys, my name is Clayton J and we're back with another YouTube video. Hey, how is it going guys? So today's video is going to be about does every transgender person want to become cisgender? And before we get into the topic, at the end of my video, I always have all my social media if you want to watch till the end, scroll to the end, whatever you guys want to do. And also in the link below in the description of this video, uh, my GoFundMe account if you want to uh, donate anything. If not, just watching these videos, watching these ads helps a lot. Thank you guys. So let's get into the topic. Uh, I have a couple things written down. I have four subjects, kind of. They're kind of weirdly scattered, uh, but let me get into them. So uh, thinking, and this is, remember, this is, this is kind of like all in my opinion, and um, I can't answer for all uh, transgender people because um, everyone has different opinions. This is mine, so thank you guys for watching. Let's get into it. Um, so first I want to say pre I'm I'm not even going to lie, pre with this question, if you gave me this question when I'm pre I would definitely say yes. Um, I definitely want to be cisgender, but now being on testosterone and uh, being able to go through all those hard times, because pre T was probably the hardest time, um, being able to go through all that hard time, now I would definitely say no, I'm glad for who I am, and going through all that made me who I am today. Uh, so starting off on like, my number one, they're kind of all weird, um, I wouldn't have left my house, like, um, it's a good thing, because... I get to know if my parents love me unconditionally. They, they're the ones that adopted me from Romania, but I guess I, it, it's kind of weird. I was born in Romania, went to Arizona, like, got adopted to Arizona. They, they bought me, bought, I don't know, they, they get, got me from um, Arizona, so I guess they only went, I don't know how far Arizona is from Iowa, but yeah, they've, they, they didn't go that far for me. But still, just thinking about it, like, they go, went through all that work to get me. And I just, like, I thought they would love me unconditionally. And me coming out, um, no, they didn't support me one bit. They they said, like, they said they did. They said, oh, yeah, I don't care what you are. I love you for who you are. Just, I just want you to be successful in life and love love yourself and shit like that. I, like, that's the stupid shit they said all the time. But then they would call me my uh, gender I don't want to go by. Like, they would call me a girl. And then they would also call me my dead name, like, my dead name's Claudia, I'm not afraid to say it. Claudia, or they would call me Claude, which I like the name Claude now, like, that's that's a sexy name, but it doesn't go with Claude J. I like to be Clayton J, you know. Uh, same initials, I like it like that. And they wouldn't respect that, you know, so that, I'm like, fuck that shit. Like, you're not respecting me, I'm leaving when I'm 18. I've had that, I even had that in my head, like, when I was, like, I swear, in, like, middle school, I was like, bro, I hate this family, you know. And I'm out. And, um, I wouldn't have left. If I, if I was cisgender, bitch, I would be there. And I would think they love me unconditionally, but they don't, or else they would have supported me. So that's, like, one thing already, like, boom. That's already, like, the number one thing, like, whoa. They already don't support me. Uh, so I don't, they're not real family, you know? Um, and I used to be a big, like, oh, family, I love family. Like, oh, Christmas, oh, like, I love having a big gathering. It's fun, but you know what? I can make my own family someday, and, you know, it'll feel the exact same. I don't need them in my life. It's fine. Um, my number two-ish is uh, meeting people. Like, I would have never met the people I meet today. Like, everyone I met, all the jobs I've had. Like, I've had a lot. Of, like, the job I'm at now, I used to love this job. Like, I'm not going to lie. I used to love this job being a detailer. I hate it now. We got a new boss. We got, um, I feel like I'm just not getting treated the right way there. But I love the hours. So, like, that's why I got the job in the first place. Uh, because I love the hours and it's okay. So, like, I don't hate the job. But, like, it's just a job now. Like, I'm not having the best time ever anymore. But... You know what? I still love the people there. Like, I have a lot of people there. And I have, like, one person there that I actually really care about. And he's, like, the coolest guy ever. And I'm really happy I met him. Um, and just everywhere I've worked, I'm really happy I met them. And they support me. I actually just kind of came out to him not recently, but he knew, I guess. And everyone there pretty much knows, you can tell, because they mess up my gender sometimes. So they obviously knew. But, like, I wouldn't meet those people. And I really probably wouldn't have been able to go through some stuff without meeting them in the first place, you know? Uh, the third one is, uh, uh, this one, it's actually a big one, too. Uh, my YouTube channel. I only made this channel, well, I remember even before I came out, but I knew what, I knew who I was. Um, I remember saying, uh, and I remember saying this to my parents, uh, my, the dad at the time and my stepmother at the time. Them literally saying I want to be a YouTuber, and them kind of just laughing it off, and me and my sister made, like, a stupid, um, cr I wish I could get that. Like, that would be the funniest thing ever to show you guys that the video of us making that we made a 
a Christmas uh, haul. And, oh my god, we, we didn't know how to work a camera. It was the funniest thing ever. That was probably my funniest memory of us. Like, my, my stepsister. Oh my god, that was funny. But, um, so I've always wanted to start YouTube, but, like, when I first started YouTube, it was because of me being trans and wanting to see my progress and all that, and then people started following me. I'm like, oh, cool, like, I, I, I can actually make a big following uh, for becoming who I am and people actually loving me for who I am. That's cool. That's a family, you know? You guys are my family, and it's cool. But let's get on to number four. The last one, just like my other video I made, I ended off on number four, but it is kind of two questions, I guess. I guess it could be two, but I kind of like separate it in two. So the first one is um, loving yourself. Like, uh, I don't even remember actually loving myself when I wasn't out, but I also kind of knew I was different anyways. But like, no, I can never love myself. I haven't really even loved myself till I started testosterone. And now I'm like, yo, and watching YouTube videos and all that and being like, bro, like, I love myself, like, I'm glad I'm trans, um, I wouldn't be in the community I'm in, and it's a loving community, I love the LGBT community, Pride, Pride Month, everything is just amazing, and it just, like, when I'm, when I'm at Pride, though, I'm like, oh my god, like, I'm at home, like, I literally feel like I'm at home, I'm like, ooh, I feel so comfortable here, it's amazing, I love everyone here, everyone's looking amazing, uh, and it's just the coolest thing ever, and everyone's dressing up, like, the drag, like, people dressing up in drag, and all, and it's, like, just cool, because everyone, you can see, like, they wouldn't wear that normally out, they'd, like, kind of scared, you know, mostly in, like, in a small town like this, no, you wouldn't wear anything like that out in public, you'd be too scared and probably get shot, like, the here is, no one here is, like, nice. Um, but, like, that's the one time you can, and it's, like, just cool, like, I feel like home there, it's just amazing. And uh, also, just how strong I am. Like, you don't know how much hate LG... I mean, you guys do. You guys are part of the LGBT community. Unless you're not. Like, I, I know some people, like that one guy that watches, and he's a cisgender male, which is amazing how you guys watch and learn more about it and even want to learn more about us, you know? Like, us LGBT community, because people usually hate us. Uh, but, like, how strong we are as a community and just, like, as one. Like, bro, like... I, I pass really good, but, like, let's just say I don't. I'll get a lot of hate. Mostly if I'm a trans woman because uh, though they were born male at birth, so like the guys will be like, yo, I can hate you. Like with me, if they figured out, they would probably be like, oh, you were born girl, so I can't hit you, know, like play that card, which, okay, cool, you won't hit me then, you know? I get out of getting hit today. But like uh, with a uh, trans woman, they're like, oh, you're born a guy at birth, I'm gonna hit you, I'm gonna kill you, you know, and shit like that, and it's sad. And oh my God, I, I remember just being pre and like, my family not supporting me and just crying every day. Maybe my parents, instead of like them not supporting me, instead of me being like, I'm gonna kill myself, which obviously I had a lot of suicidal thoughts. Um, me being like, bro, like I'm gonna beat you up. Like, like not beat them up physically, but be like, bro, like I'm gonna become something one day and you guys are gonna regret not supporting me, you know, and shit like that. And be like, bro, like I got this. Uh, but this is the end of the video and thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. I, just love making these videos. I love all you guys watching. Thank you. Um, if you guys made it this far, uh, say the word um, pen. Say the word pen. Um, or actually, no, I hate doing that. It's too dumb. Just, if you've made it this far, uh, just down in the description, because I like these more. Because if you say, like, the word, like, I make you say a word pen, it's like, bro, like, what do I say? I just like the video. I just like your comment. I don't know what to say back to you. Like, oh, cool, you know, you watch till the end. And say that to everyone. It's kind of awkward. Instead, why don't you just say what what would you guys would think if you're LGBT community, if you're, like, trans, um, or even if you're just watching and you're gay, lesbian, bi, anything, uh, would you would you just change it to be normal, like, straight or cis gender you know um tell me that down in the comments because i want to hear your guys' uh side and see like in no hate like if you say yeah i want to be cis i understand because remember when i was pre-t i wanted to be cisgender i just now am like you know what i'm happy i've never made it this far i wouldn't meet the people i'm with I, polo and molly would not be my babies you know i wouldn't have met allison i wouldn't have met anyone uh that i know of today and I have a lot of good people in my life, so I'm really thankful. And yeah, uh, comment down below what you guys think and all your guys' things. And remember, there's no hate, so it's fine. And we'll see you guys later. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Bye.